I'm Scott Summerall with Texas Instruments, and I'm thrilled to be here at CES 2025 with Mark Ng, the Director of Automotive Systems Engineering at TI. Mark, tell us a little bit about what you're excited about at the show today. Well, today we've got several demos that I'm really excited about. The first one is really a channel sounding technology, which is really the ability to use my phone as a key. And that's the technology that we have for channel sounding where we are going to be more accurate with a very low power, but also the big differentiator is the on-chip processing that we're going to have. And I talked about intelligence. This chip actually has AI that's built into it to be able to detect whether it's line of sight or not line of sight. And that's that on-chip processing, which is going to make our experience much better. Wow. And when we think about safety in the vehicle, what is TI doing there to advance technology? Well, as you know, there's going to be new end cap regulations that are going to be coming out in Europe. And that requires the ability to detect child presence in a vehicle. We have our new device, the AWRL 6844, which is a three-in-one device that can do child presence detection, intruder detection, as well as uh, seatbelt detection. So that's a three-in-one device that can not only meet government regulations, but it can also meet and, and reduce cost of an overall vehicle. And by the way, that has AI built into it. <laughs> that's incredible. Now, when we think about the future of the market and where automotive is headed, what gets you excited or what do you think OEMs will be doing in the future? I am personally excited about the next model year vehicles, if not already, where we're going to see software defined vehicles. And that means that we're going to be able to upgrade them. Um, we're going to be able to add features to them over time. And again, they're just going to become more intelligent over time. Uh, what we're doing here is we're releasing our zone reference design, which as you know, software defined vehicles need to move to a new architecture where I'm actually consolidating ECUs together, I'm adding more intelligence to it. So this features our devices like our MCUs, our high side switches, our motor drivers, um, just things to do load actuation. And that's basically what we're showing with our door demo here uh, with controlling windows and locks and so on. From bumper to bumper and roof to wheels, it sounds like TI's got you covered. That's right. Thanks so much, folks. We're reimagining the vehicle here at CES 2025.